So tonight I just wanted to make a quick video to show you guys how to clean your Gen 4 Glock 17 in about 5 to 10 minutes. It will really only take as long as you want it to take, how in depth you want to clean it, but for the most part it should only take 5 to 10 minutes or so. And your Glock 17 will be ready to go, clean, ready to shoot. And if you do this every time you go shooting, it should stay nice and reliable and last a long time. So first and most importantly, let's double check the chamber. Make sure it's clear. See, in there, there's nothing there. Chamber's clear. Okay, so the next step is you're going to have to fire the gun. And then there's these two little notches on each side. You have to push those down and just very gently release the slide back and then it comes right off from there. And then once you've got the barrel taken off, the slide taken off, you take out this spring right here, put a little pressure on it, it comes right out. And then you're just going to slide the barrel that direction a tiny bit, and then you can just pull it right out. And with how simple this gun is to clean, there's no reason why you shouldn't clean it after every time you take it shooting. Now one thing I like to use as a rag is I like to use old socks to get all that stuff out of there. It works really good. And you can reuse it a few times, and then you can also turn it inside out and use it some more. It's just one of the things I like to use. Okay, so first, let's clean the barrel. Okay. Okay, the barrel has been cleaned with the wire brush. So let's take that off. This guy on. I like to use CLP, and I just put a little bit of that on here, get it a little moist, and then let's run that back through the barrel, and then back out the way you came in. And I'll just do it again one more time just to give it a little bit more lubrication. Okay, so now let's dry that off a little bit with the sock. Get a little of that excess oil off. So the inside of the barrel is nice and lubed up. So now let's take a clean dry rag. Put that on there. And these tech mats are nice because they absorb all the oil so you're not getting the surface you're cleaning on all dirty and oily. Let's put that in there. You'll see it's pretty dirty. Not too bad. Spin it around. Alright. So the inside of the barrel for the most part is done. Now Let's put a little bit of that oil on the sock and get the slide. And do a little bit more. I'm actually going to apply it directly to the slide just to make it a little easier. Just get a little bit right there. Wipe all that excess oil up, getting all the grime and gunpowder residue off as we go. And this is just a quick clean. We're not doing an in-depth cleaning. This is just something you'd want to do quickly after shooting off some rounds at the gun range or whatnot. Just to keep things in working order. Get 
some of these harder to reach places. These the Q tip. Put a little bit of oil on there. See right in there. It's a little harder to get with the rag. Okay. And a really important spot is right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's that spot right there. Okay. It's looking pretty good. All right. Inside of the slide looks pretty good. I'll just kind of dry it off with the sock one more time. And that's pretty much it. You can get in there a little bit on all the metal parts that aren't polymer. Kind of lube it up a little bit. Get rid of all the built up gunpowder residue. see the gunpowder residue where the magazine will just kind of get that in there and put a little bit of oil right there where the slide goes just to reduce friction and crannies. Okay. For quick cleaning, that is probably good. Let's just try to get up all that excess oil out of there. Okay, so now we can go ahead and Put the Glock back together. Or actually, let's get this area right here gently with some oil. I'll just kind of get that directly on the rag. And we'll just kind of clean that all off. Get it nice and moist. Get rid of any excess friction. Alright, now we are good to go. So let's put the barrel back in. Slide that right into place, drop it down. Put the spring back in. Just pop it into that notch right there. Push back. And it should drop right into that notch. Okay, let's get the polymer frame. With the slide, you want to line it up with this notch right here. And then just pull back just like you're cocking the gun. And it's as easy as that. It's one of the great things about how simple the Glock is. It just takes a matter of minutes to clean it, keep it operating as well as it should. And what I like to do is kind of just polish the slide up with some oil just to keep it looking good. It gives it that shine once the oil dries. Gets rid of any excess gunpowder residue that's built up on the slide as well. And that's pretty much it. 
This is how you clean your Gen 4 Glock 17 in just a few minutes. This gun is ready to go. Well, thanks for watching. If you like my video, you can click the symbol at the bottom right hand corner and give me a like, and I should have more gun videos coming out at least once every two weeks or so. Oh, and one more thing I wanted to make a note of. This gun cleaning kit that I got. I got it on Amazon. And it was actually only about $25, but it's a universal gun cleaning kit. And it can clean multiple different calibers and gauges. So far, the only gun I haven't been able to clean with it was my AR-15 and my AK-47. Other than that, it's been able to clean any other firearm I've needed to, so it's been a great investment, and for under $25, it's a great deal. See, and this is the guide that shows you what tool, what handle goes for what caliber and whatnot. But yeah, I just figured I'd show that to you guys. So you can save a great deal of money on Amazon buying essential stuff like this that you need to maintain your firearms every day. So I just figured I'd throw that in there for you guys. Alright, well thank you, and have a good night.